Alrighty. What's going on, guys? Welcome. Uh, so, new stream, new game. We got Soul Hackers 2 ready to go. So, I don't really know much about it. I just think... I want to say it's like a Shin Megami Tensei game, but I'm not sure. I don't know what this game is. But let's go ahead and hop in and see how it goes. This is a work of fiction. Is the middle of the 21st century. Technology, technological progress has plateaued, and the lives and societies of humanity are now defined by a slow stagnation. Yet from the abstracted data-rich sea of Earth's information, new life has evolved. Okay, so it is an Atlas game. Game is freaking gonna give me a seizure. Ringo. <clears throat> Ringo. Ion is a conscious consensus. Born from the sea of information, without beginning or end. Though aeons pass, Ion is eternal. Ion denies all forms of boundaries that define the individual self. Contradiction identified. You have addressed me as Ringo, requesting immediate correction. I am Flamma. I was created so that the will of Ion can be put into words. Words will be a contextually vital tool for your objective. The objective of Ion is evolution. Individual existence indicates extreme retrogression. Finite physical manifestation classified under the above category. Requesting explanation regarding the necessity of a corporeal form. Our causal calculations have identified an imminent sequence of events. Ion has determined that these events represent a catastrophic threat to the future of humanity. Our role as a neutral observer is temporarily being suspended. Direct intervention is required to identify and intercept the cause of this threat. Therefore, a material form is required for material intervention. I understand and accept Ringo as the optimal form to exit observation. As Ringo, I request that Flamma provide the calculated causal evidence to prove necessity. Bro, it's like word, word salad. I don't know what the hell's going on. Can you do There's a so? lot of talking, but... What I'm getting is... This, like... Observant AI... Has identified an issue and now needs a body, so it's created one? And Ringo is that body. That's what I got.
Bro, that thing looked hella cool. A hand covered in eyeballs? Soul hackers, too. I just hope I don't need to know what happened in Soul Hackers 1. Because <laughs> I have no clue. I have even less understanding of that game than I do of this game. Morning, Ringo. Morning, Fig. Fig? So, you got born into this mess too, huh? How are you feeling? Like the world was just created five minutes ago. It hasn't been that long. If we assume this world was created at the precise moment we attained sentience, that would be 12 seconds ago, to be exact. Your individual personalities appear to be functioning as intended. Hey, Flamma? Who are we exactly? You are constructs. Your purpose is to protect the world of humanity. More specifically, you are temporary and limited manifestations of Ion. The situation will require versatility in approach and judgment. Therefore, you have been created with personalities designed to differ from each other. I mean, I'm not doubting Ion's grasp of cybernetics. These bodies seem state-of-the-art and even... organic-ish? But I thought Ion had a policy against taking physical form. And giving us our own senses of self? I think that's a pretty obvious downgrade, considering. <laughs> I think. Listen to me. If they created us, then they're resorting to drastic measures. I take it we're dealing with a crisis? The world of humanity is coming to an end. I take it that's the point of the vision you showed me. Very soon. The deaths of those two humans will set apocalyptic events into motion. So that's our mission, then. Directly intervene in the human world, and prevent their deaths. Thus averting the apocalypse? Precisely. Ion's reason for existence is to acquire information and evolve. To that end, we must ensure the world is protected. Okay, so... Who are these guys exactly? One is Ichiro Honda, a renowned computer engineer and a luminary in his field. The other is a devil summoner named Arrow. Sorry, devil summoner? The necessary information has already been provided to both of you, as well as abilities suited to your mission. And this is a... Huh. I see. So, this is what Devil Summoners used to fight. Looks like a gun to me. But okay. Are we to assume this mission will involve combat? Correct. Your new bodies have been adjusted for this eventuality. However, if your forms are damaged beyond our estimations, then we could wind up dead. As much as any human would. Correct. You are accordingly advised to exercise caution in your investigation. Sheesh. Okay, fine. I call the Devil Summoner. Fig, you take the Engineer. Understood. Designating Ichiro Onda as Target Alpha and Arrow as Target Beta. Mission status initialized. The turn around by both. Well, this will be Ion's first contact with the human world. Let's make sure we do this right.
Check. One, two. Ringo here. Currently en route to positional coordinates for target beta. What's the situation on your end, Fig? I was too late. Target Alpha, Dr. Ichiro Onda, has already been killed. Our murderers purged local surveillance footage, too. But I did find a final message on the doctor's personal device. It was scrambled with an advanced level of quantum cryptography, though. Beyond any human technology's capacity to decipher. Almost sounds like it was meant for us instead. So what's the message behind all that encryption? Covenant. That's all. What? You telling me the aliens are coming? The Covenant. Covenant. An infrequently used synonym for contract. Though there's likely a deeper meaning here escaping me. Possibly another code. I'll keep analyzing. Sounds good. We gotta find our dude. So the doctor's already dead. That means ha we're halfway to an apocalypse. Seriously though, couldn't this is not good. A drone or something. This body is so inconvenient. My surveillance range is tiny with just these two viewports. Our interference in the human world must be concealed by any means possible. Viewports. Ion's mandate for this mission is max. It's safe to assume we won't be receiving any reinforcements, drone or otherwise. But your point is made. I'll look into alternatives. Yeah, sure. Maximum secrecy. But now they've made two humanoid platforms and they're even calling for direct intervention. I assumed Ion's whole thing was always being an observer and nothing else. So this must must be way beyond. Just the rain, right? It's raining over here. Wow. Crazy. I can feel my skin reacting to this. It's all weird and shivery. An understandable reaction, considering we've never experienced it before. You'll just have to get used to it. Yeah. Great. Like how we have to get used to being stuffed into these bodies. I'm like a factory made sausage. Why bother with these human imitations? They're not exactly optimal. Our computing's just down across the board. Is this really gonna help us somehow? Ion's findings suggest that these bodies would be most appropriate for the mission. It strikes me as a form of backwards compatibility for the task at hand. Backwards compatibility I can deal with. I'd just rather not feel like a supercomputer stuck inside a grandfather clock. If you have complaints, please direct them to Flamma. You're not the only one struggling to adapt. Fine. Guess I won't get anything done by whining. As long as I'm stuck in this qualia prison, I might as well have some fun with it. We're not here for fun, Ringo. How about we cut the comms for now? I gotta focus if I want to get used <laughs> to this body. <laughs> Shut up. I'm having fun. Understood. There are hostile demons and devil cylinders in the area, so be careful. I'm on my way as well. Demons. Supernatural entities of myth and legend. Their existence has been tied to mankind's for ages, but even Ion doesn't know too much about them. And Devil Summoners, let's see, would be the humans who make contracts with these demons, using their demonic partner's powers as their own. So it looks like I've got a comp and a demon summoning program. This is all I need to fight back, huh? Seems simple enough. <laughs> hmm. All right, let's get this show on the road. All right. Where are we going? Mm. 
Okay, so back is like a toggle for dash. It's really weird. And I can't bring up a menu. I can't push start or anything. Like, game sucks. The dude we're after is already dead too? What a failure. Oh no. Don't tell me. Starting things off right. Ringo, have you located Target Beta? Oh, I found him. See for yourself. Target acquired. How horrible. Cause of death is. Well, I don't really need to spell it out, do I? Bullet to the head. One and done. Then one the and done. Is... Right. Coming. Ringo? Just what are you planning to do? I'm gonna try a soul hack. If there's any of his soul left in there, I should be able to gather him up and put his psyche back together. But there's so much we don't know about soul hacking. And it's not meant for bringing people back from the dead. There's a reason we have so many limiters on that function, Ringo. If it fails, you'll be the one who ends up paying for it. Hey, if we're not prepared to use all the tools we're equipped with, that's just a waste. We don't do this right now, and we can say goodbye to whatever leads we might have had. The entire world's... <laughs> hey, it's nice to know that you care, though. Especially seeing as we were just born. It's kind of weird, actually. Soul hacking will leave you completely exposed to the enemy. Can you at least wait until I'm there? Well, there's no telling how much a human soul will change once its body's up and gone. All we know is, the sooner we do this, the better. Understood. Just know that if you get lost in his memories, you won't be coming back. Do you understand me, Ringo? You are irreplaceable. I need you to remember that. Thanks, Faith. But don't worry. I'll make sure both of us get through this mess. For now, I better get started. Alright. <clears throat> Let's hack this man's soul. Bring him back to life. Invoking emergency override. Self-regulation suspended. Self-check process suspended. Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. Systems are go. Agent now sampling the target soul's wave signatures. Complete. Soul sync. Complete. I can say that the music is pretty freaking epic though. Process. Is this like a complete corrupted memory? Okay. Let's see this soul of yours. Arrow.
Yo, hey, feels like it's been forever. Sarua, you got a job finally, hell yeah. Is it not the Starbucks job, right? What's what job did you get? Sarua, sorry if I took forever to answer or respond. I was kind of zoning out. <laughs> Tell me about the job, bro. I have to go deeper. We have to go deeper. Ended up getting a job in a clothing shop, like a retailer, like selling clothes. Yes. This must be a memory. I've never worked at a clothing store. That's like something I've never done out of everything. I had a lot of jobs. Well, this is the only world we've got. Hell yeah. No point wasting all our time moping about it. Not the best, but good. Nice. Hey, any job's better than no job. That's what's up, though. <sighs> You'd be like folding clothes all day. <clears throat> folding clothes, helping people find the right size. Yep. Unlocking the little door for people to try it on. <laughs> is that is that what you're doing? It'll give me enough money to get coffee maker I want and the stuff I need for molecular stuff for the kitchen. What? <laughs> Just for a coffee maker? I actually have been um, drinking instant coffee. Um, like, uh, I don't use a coffee pot, right? I just have that. It's like pre-ground, pre-everything. You just mix the powder into the hot water and drink it. That's where I'm at. So is this flashback to like right when he died? Hell yeah. So uh, what have you been playing, bud? So real, what game you been? What game you been on? Are you just been working too much? No games. I was the one who was wrong. You need a coffee Sorry. grinder too. Legends Arceus. Oh yeah, Pokemon. Hell yeah. Let's go. That's like the best one out of the Past like five years, I think <sighs> Thinking about replaying Persona 5? Nah <laughs> Look what I got though. Hold on Does it pause if I don't? No, but look nice. look at that. You see it on the left? You doing Persona 5 Tactica. I got it downloaded, bro. I'm ready to start it. But I felt like I wanted to play this game. I've been putting off Soul Hackers for a cool minute, so I decided uh, let's start this boy. Oh, so you're aware, huh? Did you know you're dead too? I did. Didn't exactly go out peacefully, did you? Flo took a bullet to the face. If you just leave me alone, I'd like to spend my final moments. I want to get Game Pass so I can start Tactica. No. <clears throat> I like turned it on just to make sure like what it was and stuff and uh, I could see myself playing it for sure. It looks pretty good This is from the same universe as Persona 5. Yeah, this game. I Don't know is it I didn't think it's Shin Megami Tensei, right? I think it is So I don't know It's like so you're just gonna drown yourself in regret it has like devils serve our devil uh, summoners or whatever You know about that? Well, I only know bits and pieces. I saw some stuff on my way down. So, just what is it that you regret so badly? Who? Who are you? And why are you inside me like this? My name's Ringo. I'm an agent of Ion. Ring. An agent of Ion. Ion is an eternal, unchanging, ultra-intelligent observer of the times, born from the farthest reaches of technology. Hell yeah. Ultra-intelligent observer of the times. And the situation dictates that I... It has some like Easter eggs, right so that's cool. Because, you know... Persona reason. Easter eggs? Situation dictates that I have to look like a person right now because, you know, reasons. Wait, okay. So, 
You're not human? This has got to be a joke, right? Singularities no. typically occur outside of the public eye, but here's one right now, standing in front of you. Right. So why are you here? I'm here to bring you back. You're gonna help me prevent the end of the world. Hell yeah. We're gonna stop the apocalypse. The end of the world. Very soon, your soul will disappear. And your chance at coming back will go with it. If we don't act now, the world's as good as gone. So far in the like, what is it? 30 minutes I've played this game is very, uh, it talks a lot and like uses words that are, I don't know how to describe it. It's like word salad. I feel like it's saying a so lot without saying a lot. You know, you're going to help me stop this or not? <laughs> That's just how I feel. I'm trying to remember what other game was like that. I can't remember. There's another game that was like that. I played not that long ago. Think of this as a second chance. A chance to get it right. I... I can't let it end here. Hell yeah, let's go, bro. His bullet hole just disappeared. Welcome back. <sighs> Hello. You get in there? Soul back where it should be? You're Ringo. You're an agent of Ion. Hell yeah. There we go. Glad that actually worked. Did all of that really happen? It wasn't a dream, was it? Nope, that definitely wasn't a dream. You got shot in the head, I used my fancy ion superpowers, and then you came back. Even my wounds were straight up stuff. fancy as hell. Did Ion's power do that too? That's more like a side effect. With the soul restored, the body heals by reflex, like a macro level juiced up homeostasis, which organic cells already do. A soul Jesus. Pack can draw out all kinds of weird spiritual contingency effects, and that's one of them. That said, is that a spiritual it's a effect? Drastic measure. That's what I'm saying, bro. It's like it's using effect. weird words for what? I wouldn't call it a spiritual effect. Right. I feel like it was like a physical right. effect. Whoa, you got it that easily? You're not even a little suspicious? Wait, so it wasn't real? Was Am I just thinking too much? Or something? Is that is this me? I Am I the problem? Spell? Oh no, it's still totally real. Oh, of course. I mean, it felt pretty real. So, I died and now I'm back. Kind of get used to weird things in my line of work. Though coming back from the dead is definitely a first. I didn't even know that was possible. You ought to get out more. I guess I have you to thank for this. So, uh, thanks, Ringo. Hell yeah, as you progress through the story, you may notice occasional increases in something called the soul level. Its purpose may be unclear now, but you'll learn the truth in time. Anytime. Okay, I'd better move. I need to get back to my mission. Whoa, whoa, hey, Arrow. Mind if I tag along on that mission of yours? I get the feeling you and I might be on the same side. You know how to fight? I gotta protect him, bro. He's gonna freaking die. If I couldn't. Again. Sure. Just like that again. Your hell yeah cracks me up every time. Hell yeah. Like that? Don't have time. Hell yeah. Besides, after what happened back there. So what's up, Skylar? You got the uh, you got the the METs this week. With how bad this mission's gone, I'm not in a position to turn down help anyway. So I'll follow my instincts. Doesn't matter if you're a robot. I'm a robot. Robot's kind of reductive. Well, Ringo, whatever you are. She's also a... I'm glad you're on my side. For the record, I'm Arrow. A 
the Devil Summoner with Yadagarasu. Yadagarasu. Well, that's just a fun word to say, huh? Yadagarasu. This group based in Japan. They work behind the scenes to protect civilians from supernatural threats. Most of our operatives are Devil Summoners, like me. We summon it and command demons to help us fight. Hell that's yeah. why I was here. Yadagarasu had me on a mission to protect a woman named Melody. Melody. Well, she totally botched and got your skull ventilated. Say no more. So ventilated skull. All right. Yeah. Melody. That's the idea. Come on, this way. I feel like it's a uh, like a fancy milady. Melody. I had one day this week. Next week I have two. Mr. Betis, it's a bummer you had one today. Or you had one this week. I didn't get none this week. I got my regular ass three days off, dude. Feels good. But next week I only got Thanksgiving. It's the only day off I have. I'm on my way. I might. Uh, I might put in some UPT on another day though. I might. <laughs> I don't think I want to work six days. My legs would be killing me. All right, Arrow, join the party. Can I like bring open the menu now? I guess I can't. All right. What is that dude? Some guy in a suit. Look at that hair. Kabaraki killed you. Did we get bad intel? Damn it. Who's this? Friend of yours? He's a devil summoner from the Phantom Society. They're after Milady. Oh, Milady. so a bad guy. Damn traitor. I'll have to put you down myself. Hey, you ever fought a summoner before? Where did that come from? He pulled no. that long ass stick out of his shorts. Then you'd better stay what back. the heck? Don't worry, I catch on fast. Just watch my back, okay, tough guy? Tough guy. Is that... Demon summoning program. Leading way. The dubstep, dubstep music. Weapons free. No more screw ups. This time you're going to stay dead. Yo, <laughs> this game's a furry game. I had no idea. The spike color. Yeesh. Okay, first battle. Come on, Arrow. What? Damn it! Hey, what's the problem? I can't summon my demons. What's going on? <laughs> can't squirm out of this one, pal! Looks like Arrow's demon control privileges got transferred to my call. Hey. I get it? Probably a side effect of the soul hack. Now she's the one with the demons. What? Sorry. Kind of figuring this out on the fly, but I optimized your summoning program. You what? I'll show you how it's done. Alright. When it's Ringo's party's turn, the battle menu will be displayed. You can take various actions by pressing their corresponding buttons. First, press A to open skills, and then choose Zeo and target the boorish man. We gotta win this. Okay. No matter what. Uh, Zio. No way to tell. Noise. No way. Did you use a demon's power to attack? You can do it too, you know. Give it a try. Uh, okay. I'll just try to copy what you did. The comps wielded by Ringo and her party may be. Or have been enhanced with eye on tech and you can equip demons to them by spending MP allies can use the skills of any demons they have equipped to their comp uh, next have arrow choose Bufu the attack 
the Dormarth. Dormarth? The Cat Lady. Let's go, Cat Lady. Okay. Boo foo. Careful. Let's give it a try. Freeze where you stand. Work. The poltergeist. Oh, it's out. Oh yeah! Sabbath time! What? What's a Sabbath? It's super fun! It's super strong! It's a lot of everything! The hell's going on? Sit back and enjoy. <laughs> Thought he was the demon hunter. He doesn't know anything. Too late for her guts now. Damn, when you strike an enemy's weakness, your demons will be summoned to stand by for a concerted attack. These stored attacks are termed stacks. Once all allies have acted and their demons have formed a stack, Ringo will order them to perform a Sabbath, a united assault by all demons in the stack. The greater the stack, the more powerful the Sabbath. So target enemy weakness whenever possible. That Sounds great. Sabbath? That's insane. I Damn, didn't that was know wild. Demons could do that. I got an achievement. All right, we leveled up. Hmm. Ringo? I can't help but wonder about that demon summoning just now. I think the reason you weren't able to summon anything on your own is because of the soul hack. Huh? Simply put, your soul was altered, and it looks like a piece of each of our souls were more or less welded together. It may be because of a difference in our ability, but no matter which way you look at it, I've got control over your demons now. And there's nothing you can do about that? Not at the moment, no. There's a lot about soul hacking even I don't understand. For the time being, you'll just have to settle for some ion enhanced summoning. That's true. And on top of that, we'll be able to use more powerful techniques like Sabbaths. The pluses do seem to outweigh the minuses here. Guess I'll just have to get used to it. Looks like you're stuck with me till the end. I've got to ask, though, why'd that guy call you a traitor earlier? I was on a mission for Yadagarasu. Yadagarasu. Undercover within the fantasy Yadagarasu. They had no idea I was a double agent, but I had to protect Melody. Melody. So just like that, my cover was blown. The Phantom Society. That summoner we just beat was one of theirs? Yeah, and they're Yadagarasu's sworn enemy. The Phantom Society is a secret organization of devil summoners, just like Yadagarasu. Where we differ, however, is our intentions. They want one thing, to see this world destroyed. You mean... Exactly. Hmm. The end of the world you were talking the end about of the world. is almost definitely linked to the Phantom Society. Things are starting to come together here in a pretty big way. Safe to say. We can count Ion's appearance as part of all that. Sounds like we better hurry then. What is that? Enemy up ahead. On the field, Ringo can slash out at enemies by pressing X. Entering battle with an enemy downed in this way can give you an advantage. Alrighty. Press Y to open the command menu. Let's go, finally. Let's keep at it. There we go. Alright, let's go kill this. Oh, you know what I also want to do? Is change like how far I'm from the camera. I feel like I'm way too close to her. There we go. Now that looks normal. <laughs> I missed three times in a row. That's terrible. All right. <laughs> I'm ready whenever you need me. 
You can fast battle? I don't wonder what that is. We'll figure it out later. Um, yeah, we'll just use skills, I guess. Hmm. No data. That's one way to go about it. Huh. Huh. You know what to do. I'll try Take it away. Proud. That should work. Silent as snowfall. Too late for regrets now. Is this the Charge! Sabbath attack? Here goes nothing. What's the plan here? Let's roll. Wide open. What's our next move? Let's go. Ooh, that'll work. Don't know to lose. Uh, we can win this. Just shoot her. I was just getting started. Oh, leveled up. Yeah. Look, look. Hell yeah, we learned Dia. Yay. How about that? Needle shot. I'll take it. Hey, Ringo. Be a bit of a waste to use demons solely for fighting, you know? Oh. You mean they can be used for other things? <laughs> yeah. Recon. You can send them out to scout our surroundings. And if we get into a fight, you can just call them right back. Oh. Then how about we give it... Leaving this to you! When you first set foot in a dungeon, your demons will perform demon recon. Your scout demons can be found around the map and then might introduce you to other demons they've met or hand over any items they found in the exploration. Sometimes your demons might make discoveries connected to the story or requests, so make sure to talk to them if you see them around. Okay. Yay! Pretty girls look good in red. I got chakra drop too. I'll give you this promise you won't tell anyone I was singing, okay? Okay. Steam and interest in you, even though I'm a cuter one. Well, hey, it's one of the cat people. You want me to join you guys? I don't know. It sounds like a lot of drama. I want $1,500. Okay, go ahead. Take the money. I'll do what I can. All right, cool. We got another demon. I found some money over here. Later. Okay. Yay! Pretty girls look good in red. Shaman's mark. Bye -bye. Yeah. I'll make this Yo, he's like a big spider. Got a weird one here. Let's go with that. Keep an eye on them. Wait, wait, wait. The assist function can automatically pick an attack skill you use. Any weakness will be targeted if you are known. You can rely on this feature if you are not sure what skill to go with. 
or if you want to automatically go for an enemy's known weakness. Okay. That's pretty cool. It resisted the needle shot. Fine, no way to tell. All right. That was a joke. I found what you were looking for, didn't I? A revival bead. Later. Oh, you're a homie. A demon war. Proceed. Have you found Melody yet? Wait, Arrow? But how? No time for small fry. Let's push on through. Right. We're fighting for our own. Fine. I'll get serious. Can you handle this? Let me see. Make the call, Sign me to snowfall. Too late for regrets now. She kind of just tanked those shots. We'll take them down with this power. Here's through. There it is. Just what I. All right. You're gonna try it out. Out of my way. Charge! Why am I? I was just getting started. Nice. Dodge gunfire skill? Let's go. Yes. Right. How about that? Sukunda. <laughs> Got that ice augment. So both Phantom and Yatagarasu are after this Milady person. But just who the heck is she? It's all you guys talk about. Milady is a devil summoner from the Phantom Society. However, they've marked her as a traitor. And what about you? You must have some reason to protect her, hmm? You gonna tell me? Well, I... Eh, it's fine. I'm sure I'll figure it out sooner or later. Let's keep moving. A life stone.
Let's roll. They're going down. So we got the two augments on. Killed them both one hit. Too good. I need a break from play. A dangerous present beyond this point. Are you sure you're ready to proceed? Yes. Let's go. Bring on the danger. Oh, wait. Melody. Is that? Oh, it's Melody. Okay. Looks like we need a change of plan. Yo, man! Yo, yo, Arrow's here. Except, you ain't no ghost. Arrest. Am I tripping, man? My boys told me you were straight up dead. My buddy. If they cut your mic, stay off this This guy talks just like me. I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this clown. Who's he? <laughs> the spotlight. Yo, they call me Rod Soldier, R to the yes, it ain't hyperbole, cause I could kill on the beat, representing the Phantom Society. Straight up, huh? Okay. What is that? That's it. That's the covenant. No way. Whoa, whoa. Step off, homie. Phantom's gonna need all those covenants. Only way we can rain some hell down on the whole world. We're going live. Your boy RS, he's at the head of the pack. The posers come at me and they don't come back. I drop that face like an earthquake. You throw hands with me, you made your last mistake. Let's go. Yo, he's got a horse. Here he's a go. horse girl. Careful, Ringo. That swagger's not a front. He's tough. I didn't expect him to be a horse girl. They call me all rest because I'm a dope MC. All my boys making noise in the COMP. So let's make this body count of one, two, three. <laughs> he's awesome. They're strong. Be on your guard. Yeah, good plan. Let's stay cautious. No way to thunder. Right on target. Nice. He's weak. Well done, Ringo. Okay. Uh huh. Eat this. How's that? Out of my way. Charge! Shoot. Defense up. We can't afford to lose. The music's so good. All right. No way. You're done. That's an agent of Ion. With this power. Might as well test it. Silent as snowfall. There it is. Out of my way. So what? Got the 
the skills for the kills, cause they're genuine. Get what you get when you stop the landmine. Yeah, I'm the payoff, and you're the punchline. <laughs> Boost the tempo. Check it. They're strong. All Be right. Remember, they might counterattack. Here goes. I won't let this power Whack. silent as snowfall. My guy overlooked that. Out of my way. Shit. We almost got him. Was about to be dead right now. The danger zone attack though it sounds pretty freaking scary. Oh. We'll take them at this power. Silent as snowfall. Got me. Kidding. Get out of here, boy. Spitting gold bars. Your talk is cheaper. I'm the RS. And I don't fear no Reaper. I'm no Reaper, but I can send you to hell. So face the music, RS, and take the L. Damn. She, she dropped a bar on him. All right. Awesome. The Zan. Damn it. He had backup. Ringo. Fig. Ringo. What is this thing? What's it going to do? Is it going to go inside her? Uh, it's going into me. The covenants joining with you. Covenant. Then this was the point of Dr. Onda's message. Fig? Fig? Are you all right? Fig? I'm not detecting any abnormalities at the moment. My chest feels a bit hot, though. How strange. <sighs> so. You're a friend then? That's right. I'm Fig. Can't you tell? She got the shiny the pants just like I got the shiny Please jacket. Nice to meet you, Pleased to meet you, Fig. Are there a lot of your kind out there? There are only two like us. Ringo and I have the unique ability to directly intervene with human affairs. Just to confirm, Fig. Are we too late to save Melody through normal means? Yes. By the time I arrived, she was already... Yeesh. Two soul hacks this quick, huh? Who'd have thought? Ringo? You can't mean... Are you going to bring Melody back? Like you did with me? We gotta Think try. We know Arrow's death is somehow related to the end of the world. Arrow was trying to protect Melody. But what if we assume the trigger is not Arrow's death, but his failure to complete his mission? I can't authorize this. We don't even know if there were any consequences from the last soul hack. It'll be fine. I think I've got the hang of it. That's not the issue here. This is just to be safe. We need to be thorough, and that means cutting this thing off at every turn. And not only that, but I agreed to help Arrow protect Melody. So that's what I'm gonna do. Understood. I'll keep watch. Can I ask you to do the same, Arrow? Uh, right. Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. Systems are go.
process complete. You think that little jolt can I end up getting something? Or does that just happen all the time? This is an unjust world, a false world. Let's destroy it together. What? so mournful too just like him so he's the dude in the mask the dude that killed the doctor right So hope you brought a casket. Oof, zip, talk about a fall. Rs has got you with your back against the wall. Hey, what's that? Lady, you don't have to glare like that. My name's Rango. I'm an agent of Ion. I'm a super intelligent being born from the Sea of Information, and I'm here to stop the apocalypse. And what does this super intelligent being want with a dead woman? Well, Melody, how about I show you? Just come with me, and we'll go back. I'm dead, you simpleton. There's no going back. Why are you even here anyway? I'm gonna save the world. That's more than the world deserves. Okay. Guess it's gonna take a little more than that. So that's it. This is where you die, and you're okay with that? Because it sounded to me like you had something you still needed to do. You were running away. You wanted to survive. So take my hand, Melody. And you can survive. You'll get one more chance to make things right. Nice. Hey, she's back. I guess it's true. Ion really is something else.
What the hell? Lady, we just brought you back to life. Why are you acting crazy? So Ion is a non-human being born from a bunch of information, and you're like a splinter of it. That much I get. That also explains how I'm back from the dead. What I don't understand is why you're here. Wait, Melody! We're not with Phantom. We're here to protect you. Hmm? What are you talking about? Right, so, uh... I'm actually with Yadagarasu. My being with Phantom was all an act. These two here are helping me with my mission. Yadagarasu? Then you're still my enemy. Yeah, Garasu. Only if you're still a summoner. Yeah, Garasu. So much fun to say. Two, aren't they? Doesn't seem like either of us is in the best spot. <sighs> Could you even go back to the Phantom Society at this point, Melody? I think it'd be kind of hard. <sighs> What's your point? I'm saying we can help you. And it's not like we're asking you to spill your soul, so why not hear what we have to say? If your only concern is what you'll get out of it, that's fine. Even if you decide to act alone, a little more info couldn't hurt, right? <sighs> I suppose I'll take you up on your offer. For now. Then, it looks like Melody's safe and sound. Sure took a lot of effort, though. Now then, we'll want to go over everything we've learned so far. That should help us get a better understanding of the situation. There's still way too much we don't know. Like about covenants and how you two factor into all of this. For now, we should get out of here. This place is dangerous. But where should we go? If you need a place, I've got a safe house I've been using. We should be free to talk there. <sighs> Thank you, Arrow. Let's hurry then. Oh yeah, we got a safe house. Let's return to the entrance. Nice. They got magic portals too. To the safe house. The covenant that appeared from Milady's corpse was unexpectedly absorbed. Okay. The open mouth smile. Hmm, not really what I expected, but it's not bad. Glad you like it. Fig, Millity, feel free to make yourselves at home, too. Thank you for everything, Arrow. <laughs> okay, let's get right into it. Arrow, you were trying to save Millity because of that light form thing, right? Guess there's no point in hiding it now, is there? Yeah, that's right. The Covenant came out of Millity and then went into me. <sighs> of course. It's because I died. I get that these Covenant things are important somehow, but I'm only just now starting to wrap my head around it. Can you tell me more about them? You two are Devil Summoners, after all. <laughs> all right. This is my understanding of it. Covenants are like a big source of energy, and they've been passed down from soul to soul for generations. Supposedly, these Covenant holders wield great power. What kind of power? Well, simply put, 
possessing a covenant awakens the holder's latent abilities. In some cases, it can even spark, well, evolution. They say there's a total of five covenants out there. Having one as powerful as it is. Imagine Fig. Uh, go as far as the individual could take them. Fig like evolves, gets stronger, and then she turns bad. She gets corrupted by the power. That'd be sick. Now, if someone were to possess all five, and that'd be something. You could what? Ooh. You could call forth what's known as the Great One, a being prophesied to bring ultimate destruction to the world as we know it. That's what they say, at least. Maybe the great one is that giant hand with the eyes. Summoning this great one is Phantom's top priority. Am I right, Melody? Please, you don't really need me to confirm that, do you, Mr. Double Agent? If the Holder dies, the Covenant gets passed on to someone else. As a result, there's almost always some sort of conflict surrounding them. What a surprise. I see now. So when Melody died, the Covenant found a new owner in Fig. These covenants and this world-ending Great One you mentioned. I believe these may be the seeds that make Ion's prediction come true. Gotta be. Considering we're trying to stop the end of the world, the Phantom Society's shaping up to be a pretty big obstacle. Agreed. And now that we know their intentions, we must protect this covenant inside of me at all costs. That's going to be a problem for me. What the hell? Get it, Melody. Our summoning abilities are changed. We don't have control over our demons. Ringo does. We think it might be due to the soul hack. Excuse me? No one told me about this. Don't look at me. There's no reason to blame Arrow. There's no point in blaming Arrow. He's in the same boat as you, Melody. Go ahead and explain it to her, Ringo. Well, it's not as if I wanted to take your powers. I'm not all that sure how it happened myself. I sincerely hope you don't intend to steal my freedom as a summoner. That's exactly the kind of low tactic Yatagarasu would pull. Yatagarasu. No, you've got it all wrong. I really was trying to help. Were you? Then can you prove to me that you and Little Miss High Tech here aren't in on this together? All right, that's enough. Melody, just what is the Covenant to you? I don't think I need to explain why the Phantom Society needs summoners, do I? Right. So you're after the end of the world too, huh? <sighs> hey Ringo, mind if I ask you something? Sure, what's up? Ion aren't human, right? So why was the Covenant passed on to Fig? What are you, really? We agents of Ion are highly intelligent beings born from a sea of information. By installing an ego into a simulated human body, the foundation is laid for a soul to develop alongside it. So a machine can have a soul? Is that so strange? Your bodies are practically machines too. Albeit fleshy ones. Even for our kind, there is still a lot about the soul that remains unknown. Like where they come from, or what they truly are. We're no experts either. But the self-evident truth is, should one accurately recreate a human body and provide it with a means of control, then a soul will naturally take root. In other words, it's not just this mechanical shell, or rather, this body at play. It's a How are you liking the game? Different physiological it's pretty cool. The soul. It's a lot of talking. I like that though. I don't mind. Um, and it's like very sci-fi-y. End of the world. Cool, crazy robot people and demons it's basically got it checks off all the boxes you know it's pretty good so far it's just been really slow that's my only thing the, like the only thing i could gripe about so far okay then we're supercomputers trapped inside grandfather clocks in even plainer terms our origins may be different but we are more or less the same as humans the trade-off is in this form, we can't operate at Ion's full power, nor do we have access to massive amounts of data like we used to. Ah, I see. I guess that's why they said this form was the most ideal for our mission. You can't really soul hack if you don't have a soul yourself, can you? Oh, that's right, Ringo. I meant to tell you earlier, but I've made a new discovery. It's about Target Alpha, Ichiro Onda. If I remember right, that's the famous computer engineer. What about him? 
Fig was acting separately from me at the time. She was trying to protect Onda just as I was trying to protect you, Arrow. The mission was a failure, but I managed to restore the surveillance camera footage. I found a video of what happened in the 24th Ward Municipal Tower. And? He was killed by someone named Iron Mask. Did you say Iron Mask? That's her boyfriend. The leader of Project C finally makes his move. It was him. So, you know him. Or well, I guess you would, seeing as you two are together. You are? He called himself Iron Mask. Are you absolutely certain? Let's take a look at the footage. Output in video. Impressive. I can't imagine how many security measures were in your way. You're no mere trespasser. Ichiro Onda, I presume. The greatest computer engineer of our time. It's a pleasure. And you are? I am the leader of Project C. You may call me Iron Mask. <laughs> a bit on the nose. Was Black Suit taken? Or are you a prisoner broken free? Well, it's fine. You're welcome to celebrate with me, Masked Man. So is your little wallflower. <sighs> it's complete. A system to shatter the status quo with a perfect name to shake the very foundation of Akadate. The Omni System. Glorious, isn't it? Can't you feel its power? But now it's finished, and I'm done with it. If you're a thief, then go ahead and take it. You've designed a masterpiece, Doctor. The Omni System will uplift mankind to new heights. Alas, I'm afraid your part in our grand pageant ends here. We want something quite different from you. I should have known. If you don't want my creation, then you must be after me. Well, what dwells within me? You want the Covenant. Ah, you're already aware. You do know I'm a genius. Oh, man. gift from a genius. No one can control the future. Iron Mask. I have a future. Oh, man. Ichiro Anna. Your covenant serves you well, but it will serve me far better. So that's it. 
Ichiro Ando was a Covenant holder too. And we got a good look at Iron Mask. Plus, whatever that freaky, murdery guy was. <laughs> murdery guy. The guy that tore out Ando's Covenant, you mean? Strength like that definitely isn't human. Maybe it's some new species of bear or something? Bear? Come on, lady. You were on Iron Mask's team. Know anything about that? Not really. All I know is he called that thing Zenin. He also referred to it as a vessel for the Covenants. A vessel for the Covenants, huh? It seems he lacked the power to fend off their attack. Say, Milady, if you and Iron Mask are an item, why is he after you? <laughs> Ringo, what would you say to working together? You help me meet with Iron Mask. What's in it for me? I'll help you prevent this end of the world or whatever you've been going on about. And I'll give you all of the Covenant Holders' names. Deal? You sure? I thought you wanted the world to end. Some things take priority. All right then, Melody. It's a deal. Rather quick to trust, aren't you? Not at all. But we both benefit from this. And for now, that's all I need. Speaking of which, I'm hoping we can count you in too, Arrow. Sure. It's not like I don't have stakes in this. All right, then. It's settled. Let's all just try to get along from here on out. <sighs> uh, what did I just say? You call that getting along? Arrow, did you do something to her? No. At least, I don't think so. Oh, really? Yatagarasu never did anything to interfere with the Phantom Society's plans? Well, that's nothing new. Phantom and Yatagarasu have been at each other's throats for forever. I hate it when humans act like this. Hey, Melody, maybe try to look at Arrow as his own person, rather than as a member of Yatagarasu. I suppose I can do that. On to the main topic. Melody, if you could go over the Covenant Holders for us. Right. These are the five people the Phantom Society had marked as Covenant Holders. First is Iron Mask, leader of the Covenant Recovery Project, or Project C. He's a Covenant Holder as well. The Covenant Recovery Project. How is the Phantom Society able to identify these individuals? A Covenant Holder can detect another simply by looking at them. A quick glance in their direction is all it takes. Mm. Coupling that with the organization's power, the Phantom Society has been able to identify Covenant holders for a long time. Up next, we have Ichiro Onda, our late computer engineer. He held a Covenant, but had no summoning ability. Going off the security footage we just saw, his Covenant is currently being held by that man, Zenin. This means Iron Mask is in possession of at least two Covenants at this time. The third Covenant holder is a Devil Summoner, Mangetsu Kuzunoha. I imagine a certain someone here knows a lot more about him than I do, though. He's one of Yatagarasu's top devil summoners, and one of the key players in protecting this country. There you have it. The fourth is a man named Saizo, who operates out of Karakacho. He's a freelance summoner who's had dealings with both Yatagarasu and the Phantom Society. And lastly, our fifth covenant holder was me. Though that's clearly not the case anymore. That's the one I currently have. So many of them have switched owners in such a short time. It's kind of hard to follow. Hang on a sec. Does that mean Iron Mask was targeting those two Covenant holders at once? If that's true, then the others could be in danger too. Milady, any idea where Saizo might be? Word is, he's typically hanging around Bar Hydron about this time. It's over on Jinsando Street. Then that's where we gotta go. You coming, Fig? I'll wait here for everyone. If worse comes to worst, we can't allow our enemies to obtain any more covenants. That said, you'll need an operator of sorts to appraise the situation. So allow me to play that role from the back end. Roger. We'll let you handle things here then. Hell yeah. The safe house is the team's base of operations. If you select rest from the menu, the party will fully recover. Also, certain downloadable content items can be collected from the safe house. Alright. I think what we will do is save the game.
all right cool so 20 minutes of game game that's it oh no playtime that's what time i stopped okay playtime is an hour and a half all right cool well <laughs> i think that is it for me i am kind of tired it's sunday i got work tomorrow so for now thank you guys for hanging out with me thank you for coming by and saying hi and if you're watching this on youtube i appreciate that too you guys have a good day good night see you tomorrow maybe tomorrow after work we'll see how it, yeah i'm not sure yet but i kind of want to start playing more often i usually only play on my days off but i kind of want to throw some days on in the week we'll see but for now see you later adios